into a significant development in military relations between Iran and Pakistan. Brigadier General Hamid Vahedi, the commander of the Iranian Air Force, has just landed in Islamabad for an official visit. This marks a pivotal moment as both countries strengthen their military ties. This visit follows a notable meeting where the Iranian ambassador to Pakistan met with the chief of naval staff of Pakistan. It's clear that defense cooperation is becoming a key focus in their bilateral relationship. While details about General Vahedi's agenda remain under wraps, the timing has sparked plenty of speculation. Notably, reports suggest Iran has formally requested Pakistan's advanced JF-17 Block III fighter jets. If this request is confirmed, it could signal a major shift in regional military dynamics. The JF-17 Block III is the latest iteration of the multi-role fighter jointly developed by Pakistan and China, featuring cutting-edge avionics, advanced radar systems, and enhanced combat capabilities. It's an appealing option for nations seeking high-performance, cost-effective aircraft. For Iran, which has faced international sanctions limiting its access to modern defense technology, acquiring these jets could be a game-changer for its aging air fleet. Meanwhile, Pakistan has been promoting the JF-17 as a key export product, with successful sales to countries like Nigeria and Myanmar. Iran's potential acquisition of these jets would not only strengthen its military capabilities, but also signify a deeper military partnership with Pakistan. This development could reshape security alignments in the region, raising concerns among neighboring countries and global powers closely monitoring military advancements. If Iran successfully adds the JF-17 Block III to its arsenal, the implications for regional security, especially in the Middle East and South Asia, could be profound. This acquisition might also affect Iran's relationships with its traditional rivals, such as Israel and Saudi Arabia, who are always on the lookout for Iran's military developments. So, what do you think? Could this potential deal change the balance of power in the region? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates on military and geopolitical developments. Thanks for watching.